Hello and welcome to Tales of Maze, y'all, and the new expansion comes out today, February 23rd, 2016. This is, uh, basically allows us to play orcs. This is, uh, an entirely orc, uh, orc yeti and white hooves are the new races. That, uh, this is a, a playable version of, of that. There's a whole new story, which I will put a link in the description, uh, to the Steam page, which gives you all of that. Uh, we also have some new classes. We have, um, under the tinkering classes, we have gunslingers, saw butchers, and psi shots. So we're going to try some of those out. Uh, new game, let's play it. Let's try it out. Um, these are kind of a, a kind of a steampunky sort of, of uh, feeling to the orcs. I've, I messed around with just, just a little bit to kind of get an idea of what I was doing and remember my key bindings. But uh, we're going to try a new orc. I haven't played enough to unlock anybody else, but we just we have an orc. And we have, we have a choice between a saw butcher, which is a formidable behemoth of war using steam saws to improve his deadliness. Which I'm assuming is like a handheld saw. Which sounds pretty exciting. Or we have a gunslinger, which this guy looks awesome. And he's a tinker who dual wields steam guns to great effect. Most important stats are cunning and dexterity. Let's try this guy. I'm going to be, let's say, good, uh, a good orcish name. Uh, Nook. Nook with a C. Nook with a Q. Nook. <laughs> there we go. Perfect orc name. All right, so we needed, uh, what was it, cunning and dex are what we needed. So we've got three stats in our, uh, here, as usual, start the game. We'll do one in dex, we'll do one in cunning, and um, we'll do two in dex. How about that? All right, so we get two class points. So we're like a gunslinger. I need, um, oh, I need more dex to get the, the steam gun mastery. So we can pick strafe, which um, in one motion... Uh, oh, you learn to fire while moving. In motion, you f in one motion, you fire your double steam guns, and then may move to an adjacent tile. Oh, okay, try that. And then we have overheat bullets. By sending a stream, uh, a stream of hot steam over your bullets, you overheat them. For the next three turns, each bullet will set the target ablaze, making it burn for 29 fire damage over five turns. Nice. Yes. Uh, what else do we have? We have automated cloak tessellation. I'm out of, I use my points there, but I can redo it. Uh, you tessellate your cloak with small pieces of metal, providing five damage reduction against all attacks. Okay, and then we slip away, which is using small steam motors to enhance your movements. You are able to slip past up to one foe in a line. Okay. I'm happy with those two that we picked. Uh, for our generic points, we can pick Orcish Fury. We have one point in there already, which allows us to summon our lust for blood and destruction, especially when the odds are against me, increasing my damage per enemy in line of sight. Okay. Dagger Mastery, which is lame, because daggers are for lame people. Smith uh, allows us to uh, create tinkers. Smith tinkers. So, lots of crafting. Therapeutics allows us to make uh, salves and things. And then we have Emergency Steam Purge. You open all steam valves at once, releasing a radius 3 wave of superheated steam around yourself, which deals 82 fire damage. If you have at least 50 steam, the vapors will be so hot that they can burn sensory organs, blinding affected creatures for two turns. That is amazing. Yes, we want that. Okay. Yes. Uh, welcome, Nook. You are a member of the prideful but dwindling orc race. Throughout history, your race has been hated, hunted, and mercilessly killed by others. It also committed lots of atrocities and destruction. It's a lot of atrocities and destruction. But now, the orcs are on the brink of extinction. All their strongholds in Virael have been destroyed either by the Sunwall or the one you named the Scourge of the West. One of the four prides on the mainland stood... Uh, of the four prides on the mainland, none stood. They all fell, and very few of their members were able to flee. Only the Crook Pride, stationed on the Orc or Clork Peninsula, still stands. But for how long? The Sunwall outpost blocks the way to the mainland, and the peninsula itself is home to an advanced race of aggressive giants who mastered steam technology. And now the giants have dug a tunnel through the mountains right into Crook, pouring out of it the end of the pr uh, to end the Pride once and for all, while the bulk of the Crook forces are away. They must be stopped at any cost. If Crook falls, the Orc race dies with it. You grabbed a bomb from the stalks, and now you must enter the tunnel and detonate it. On a weak spot to make the crum make it crumble, for the orcs, for Gorkruel's legacy. Okay. Okay, so we are, uh, you know, our Wild West orc right here, and this is our home, Crook's Pride, and these are the giants we're going to deal with. We have steam giants, 
Standing here, he's uh, carrying a sword. Sword. And this guy has a gun. A steam giant gunner. We have a few orcs around here helping us as well. So uh, here's our stats. We, our abilities we have. Orcish Fury. We should do this one. Increases damage by whatever's in our line of sight. Yes, I will do that. Um, this is our shoot. This is create tinker. This, here's our strafe ability we picked up. So we can be able to shoot and move at the same time. Implant steam generator. Steam generator that permanently creates 5 steam per turn. Can be activated for an instant burst of 25 steam. Okay. Implant medical injector. Uh, using therapeutics with 100% uh, efficiency. This is our heal. Healing salve. We have a frost salve. Removes one physical effect. And overheat bullets. This one, I'm excited about this. I want to use this one. I almost want to charge up there and use it just to get it used. Uh, that sounds like it would be dangerous though. So let's just shoot things. Wait, overheat bullets. No, I'm thinking this one. This one. Emergency steam purge. This is where we open all steam valves at once. What's the radius? Range. Melee personal. So we have to be on them. But it'll deal 95 fire damage. Nice. Okay, so let's overheat our bullets. Uh, that's not overheat bullets. No, no, no. Uh, we want to overheat our bullets. And we're going to blast this guy. Okay. Um, and this one. Hit this. Hey, we hit the uh, steam giant guard for 22 and 27. Uh, that one. Killed that one. That's my bolt. That's, that's my gold. Yeah, everyone lay off of that. That one. Nook shot hits the orc gunslinger for 20. What, what are you what? Oh, he's trying to steal my gold. Oh, you dirty orc. Um, all right, well, shoot this guy. Don't walk in front of my bullets. Okay. Burning. F Wait, no, burning. Oh, <laughs> we just killed our friend. <laughs> oh, blind. What? Oh, no. Okay. There we go. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. It's rough being an orc. All right. Okay, to the caves. So we have a bomb. We must enter the caves and detonate it at a weak spot and uh, save our family. Well, the family that we have that's left that we didn't kill just a second ago. Uh, we will shoot him. We do a lot of damage. We've got two. We have two guns. Oh, I'll show our inventory off as soon as we. Okay. So we have our two iron steam guns. Uh, we have a leather armor, rough leather armor. Uh, we have the, a pouch of iron shots, which uh, I like the way that ammunition is dealt with in this game, because it sort of just regenerates kind of over time, which is a much better way than either just run around and pick up arrows, which is annoying. Linen cloak and an awesome leather hat. Okay, let's continue. Same as before we hit Z and we can just fast forward things. We have a... what are you? Another steam giant with a sword. Um, we can hold control. Go and try to hit him. He's a little out of range. Yeah, out of range. Out of range. There we go. I'm eager to try these other abilities. Oh, here we go. This is it. Um, we're going to walk up to him, and we're going to do our steam thing. Oh, you hit me for seven. Okay, so we're going to emergency steam purge. Oh, 83 fire damage. He shrugs off the blinded effect. But I hit him for 83. Nice. Oh, we got to level up out of that. All right. Level up. Okay, so we get three more stats. I kind of... I want this one. Steam Gun Mastery. We need Dex 24, though, for it. We're not going to get there. We can get... Uh, we can get kind of close. Two more levels we can get. I don't think it's going to happen. Um, I like that overheat bullets. Let's do that one. One more generic point we can put into... I think I got to put it into this one. That was fantastic. Uh, does 82 to 111 fire damage. Now it does 111 to 134 fire damage. Nice. Oh, no, no, that's next level. Next level is 134. This is 111. Okay. 111 damage from that. Nice. Okay. Keep on looking for the next things to kill. Um, oh, here's where we try our strafe. So we will strafe. We, I guess we shoot it first, and then we choose where to jump. But we can't jump backwards because that didn't work. Shoot, and then shimmy. Yeah, there we go. Uh, oh, this will work. This will work well. Strafe is still on cooldown. 
Um, here, we'll do that. We hit him for 112. Nice. He shrugs off the blinded effect. Steam Purge is available again. Well, we will use it again. Yeah. <laughs> How did he hit me? Hits Nuke for 14 mind damage. Okay. He's one of those guys. Oh, this guy has a gun. We'll do the bloodlust. We should do our bullets, fiery bullets. There we go. Now he's burning. He's burning for 18 damage. Yeah. We got him. Uh, what do we have here? We have Steam Giant, and we have... What are you? Can I see you? Here we go. Commander, Commander Freylor, boss. Level 6. 472 hit points. Okay. Uh, well, we, well, we will do that. Orcish Fury. And we will light our bullets up. And we're going to start firing. We're out of range. It was the only problem. I should have waited around. Oh, a terrible shot because we're out of range. Take out his friend. Oh no! What was that? What did you do to me? Spring grapple. Oh, well, that's a problem. Okay, so we're gonna strafe successfully this time. We're going to shoot him. Uh, why didn't I strafe? Pin to the ground. That would be a problem. Nice. I mean, we hit him for pretty well. I'm not feeling well. Not feeling well at all. Um, let's heal. I have don't have any ammo left. Well, that's a problem. All right, we'll just run until we get some bullets back. <laughs> okay, overheat bullets. Okay, we got him. Oh, he's so low. He's so low. He's got one hit point. All right. What? What does refuse damage mean? What does that mean? He has unstoppable, which I'm guessing is giving him some sort of resistance. Okay. He's still unstoppable. Oh, he died. Good. We burned him. <laughs> he burned. All right, that's the way to do it. <laughs> so here's our rod of recall. Massive hammer is formed with a thick mass of... Oh, no. Tirakai's maul. Thick, massive, strange, crystalline growth. Is inside the hammer itself, you see an empty slot. It looks like a gem of your own could easily fit inside. Ooh. And our rod of recoil we've, we just found. Okay, what else do we get? Anything else? Oh, gauntlets of dexterity. I need, I need the talent armor training before I can wear them. Reinforced iron shield of lightning resistance. Which we need armor training level 2. There's an elm... Star Staff. We need magic. And here's his maul. Which I don't, I'm not going to use a maul because I am not a... I'm, I'm, a, I'm a, not a melee guy. But I can put it in my offhand. There we go. Okay. There's money on the ground here. Oh, this is it. Uh, you place the detonator. You have 220 turns to get out or be destroyed by the, the explosion. Use a rod of recall. Quest, Homeland, we save the day. Done. Of Steamer Campaign, we have a new we have a new quest now. To win the war, you must help Pride by striking a blow of the giant's moral morale and spy lines. Must assault the vaporous emporium and crush the morale of the Atmos tribe. Must explore the Yeti cave and destroy the patriarch. Okay. We gotta get out now though. So let's we I mean I guess we can use the rod of recall. Let's use a rod of recall. We have it. Use it. What happened? Trans transmogrification chest. You you close inventory window. All items in the chest will be transmogrified. Yeah, transmogrify it. Um, I don't know. I don't know. Um. 
do it. I'm not using it. Gain gold. Sure. Transmogrify it. Okay. Wait, did I die? Oh, I, I died. Because I, <laughs> cause I... Wait, how did this happen? Wait a minute. Wait, wait a minute. Did I not leave the cave? I guess because I... <laughs> I hit Z. I So I did the stamp rub. I could have just walked outside. When it said I did the, the staff of recall, I thought that would be a cool good thing to do. But apparently I decided to just hang around while the cave blew up. Uh, yeah. I'm ready to go back. Thanks. <laughs> Alright, we probably should put a cut here anyways. Thanks for watching. This is basically just a quick look. Uh, we're outside. There's our, our home. This is the cave that we just caused a cave in at. Um, yeah, so thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Ha, ha, ha.